Good enough. We actually have healing items. The big reason I'm keeping these guys up front is because they can just AOEs. Yeah, carpet bomb everyone in submission. Makes sense. Although at this rate, Aeon's going to run out of TP before we even get halfway through the dungeon. So maybe a good idea to just keep just keep, keep Tristan for yeah. the for extra bopping power. Yeah. I love how that's how we describe it now. We'll just bop everything. He's not even really slashing most of the time, though. It just looks like he's using a club. See the mini treasure chest and a safe one down there. Which one do I want to buy? Probably the tag one. Oh, there are two tags. I'm going to go with this one. That's going to hurt. We can stop that. Leave Fritz alone. would be worth potentially using the uh, Zagat Claws for? Yes, but not at the moment. Not, not given the abilities we have now. Get to the save point, get to the save point, get to the save point. Oh. So I can feel the relief washing over me. We haven't saved since Unicorn Headquarters. <laughs> mm. Alright, so... Cast this again. Are there any treasure chests? They they oh. are, but they're over here, and the they were separated by a wall. And this one right here. Sword drinks are going to come very handy. So we have like three doors to go through. We have uh, one at the top, one at the bottom, and one in the middle. Which one do we go? Top. Top. All right. I can't shoot all with the uh, 
Actually, wait. Can I can I shot burst? I don't have the energy for it. Yes, first I shot burst. I forgot about that. I still would have to wait till turn three to do it though, so may as well just go in. Both of them no shot burst. So it might actually be worth charging and just waiting a third turn to just wipe everything out and won't go. I don't know. Oh, that one on the end's gone. After this next hit, but the one next to him completely missed. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That'll do it. That was nasty. Man. That will do it. Now, if he, if he melees, he's going to lie now. Chicken. Chicken, cheap, 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 cheap. cheap. And. <laughs> Arm machine gun for you. Yeah. Gotten a good bit of money from this dungeon and nothing else. Yep. Dang. So, even though we normally go and we binge on... <laughs> okay, so what I was going to say is, we normally just go and buy a whole bunch of weapons as soon as we get a lot of money. What I suggest we do this time, since we're going to be getting the Yakushiki and the Zeta here soon, I'm waiting for upgrade now. Buff the mobile suits before we go and buy the weapons. Probably. A good idea. This uh, is where I thought we were going to be coming yeah. back. Yeah. I meant to heal. I think we may wait. We got the cycle. We did. We're good. You look nasty. Death Mark Two. Super Gundam. He's boosting, so I'm just going to defend this turn. I don't remember what he has. Does he have shot burst? Oh, nope. Yep. That's going to hurt. Ow. Didn't even have... Oh. He didn't eat me, though. Okay. Leave. I'd say leave Fritz alone. Alright. Shoot all the shoppers next turn. Does shoppers hit everything? Yes. White and shoppers. Alright. I would just defend with them again. And Mega Slash for his face. I'm honestly on the fence because I don't know which one does more damage, Mega Slash or Power Charge. Power, Power Charge ignores their defense. And it ignores counters too. Meg Slash does more raw damage. This one pierces harder. In the same Go sense. for yeah. Go for Mega Slash. And I'm gonna shot burst with him next turn too. Just defend. Here we go. Ow. All right. Now, shot burst with this big honking beam cannon. And I'm gonna poke, I'm gonna slash you. And we're gonna do it. Yeah. And. Uh, spray launch. Yeah, it's still spray launch. Because it really doesn't have a really great gun equipped on him at the moment. Yeah, it's deadly. Maybe we should dish the saber and try to focus on range power. Because he's a kind of a blend of both. Oh, that was pathetic. But here comes Fritz with his shot burst. With a bigger gun. Yeah. Pack the job done. No. And it comes up. Not quite. Do they count their own text? They do, but he should be close enough to death that it shouldn't matter. You swap to Vargas and yeah. I'm actually going to speed lancer him so he can't get. Actually, you know what? We're fast enough that whatever he texts is going to. is going to. Yeah, go sure. after us. So. Vargas with his. Snipe assist. Vargas basically gets to attack us. Yeah. <laughs> the big middle finger <laughs> laser pursuit cut to the face. Too bad this laser pursuit could not make him switch factions. <laughs> no. 
the turf. Didn't matter. <laughs> Missed the one that mattered the most. I won't I want too bad. All that death army I expect any more credits than that. There were only three mobile suits. Yeah. Alright, so we're on the other side of this little wall right here. Should I go back and save, like, immediately? Or do you think we're... Think I we're think we're good. Uh... Now I can get the treasure box that's right there. Walk around, get this treasure box. Here we go. Oh, there it is! Tristan, look! Here's a piece of Hyakushiki data! Alright, this will give us what we need to face Blade. Well done. Mission accomplished. Come on, let's get back to Astonis. He may uh, also have finished repairing the gap. So, do you want to keep exploring, or do you just want to go ahead and head out? Uh, depends. Do you want me to just explore the rest of it during grinding, or...? Well, I kind of want to show them where, like, more treasure is in different parts, in case we miss something. Eh, let's finish out the dungeon. Yeah, just keep exploring, because I don't think there's that much Death Army left here. But there, I know there's a lot that we haven't explored yet, so... But Actually, here's what I think we should do. Yes. Let's go make the Hyakushiki real quick. Come back with Get it. the Zeta, upgrade what we can, and then come back with us. Uh, tiny spoiler, the Zeta is going to take a little bit of sort of progressing to actually get made, so we can't uh, do it immediately. Okay, we can still get the Yakushiki. True, and hey, if we have to find some more money, we can just dump all of it into the Yakushiki. And this is just winding tunnels, apparently. And oh, it looks like the exit of this place almost. Ah, parking lot. Because this whole, this whole free parking. It's for real estate. If this were Mega Man Battle that we're game, there would have been a ghost enemy hiding right there. Uh, not today, Satan. So yeah, I think the only other place we haven't explored besides this little patch right here is back at the save point. The, uh, is that third route that we didn't take. Yeah. So, whoop, around this path. I want to say that there's one more red crystal enemy in here somewhere. I just don't remember what it is. Just 
So while well, I should repair? Yeah. Oh, we're not. What's that? Tristan, come here. What in the world's going on? Something terrible's happening. Just look at the screen. People of Earth, I am Blady Zarf, the rightful heir of Rivage Zarf. You blame the Zarf family for the Great Fall. You call us an evil organization. You have been told lies. Mankind's own dependence and greed brought about the Great Fall. The G system wasn't created to protect the Earth. It was created to satisfy mankind's own lust for power. Misuse of the G-System destroyed the Earth's environment and wiped out 90% of its population in the process. That is the truth of the Great Fall. Yes, the G-System went out of control. But those who used it unwisely are to blame. Foolish people of Earth, hear me now. Fear the neo -Zarth. The Zarth family has risen once again! This is a formal declaration of war. I will restore peace and order by any means! Not exactly how I pictured the most of that mask. How could this happen? He declared war on the entire world? Things have really taken a turn for the worse. And to top it off, he somehow gained control of the Eisenbrand army. What's going to happen to the world? Restore order to this world? By any means? Is he serious? He fooled me once, and now I know what he's really after. He doesn't want order. All Lady Zarth really wants is revenge on all mankind. We're the only ones who can stand up to the neo -Zarth. Come on, everyone. It's time we went back to Isengrad. <laughs> Alright, it's counterattacking time. I'm going with you, too. This time it's personal. Ooh, I can't wait to get my hands on that one. <laughs> Listen to all of you. It's hard to tell which side is the bad guys. I must agree. Well, not so fast there. What about the Zeta gun? What about repairing the gown? Isengrad lies on the other side of the ocean. Do you plan to swim there? We don't have time to waste. I know you're sure on time, but we finished repairs. Your gown is heading here as we speak. Really? Now that's what I call good timing. Tristan, have you found the Hyakushiki data? Yeah, and your assistant took it from me. Uh, yes, yeah. we gave the data to Lyra. All right. I won't be able to create the Zeta Gundam right away, but I can uh, do a Hyakushiki. Sorry to leave you guys, but I better get started. Just come see me in my room later. Don't forget. Thanks. Right, so, so we'll go get the Hyakushiki in sight? Yes. Fun fact. Here we go. Tristan, I finished the Hyakushiki. I have plenty of data, so it didn't take me long at all. No. James Mold's using the garage, yes. It may not be as strong as the Zeta Gundam, but it still packs, packs a pretty serious wallet. It's got a few quirks, but once you get it figured out, it works like a dream. Thanks. Now we've got what we need to take them on. It looks like it'll take me longer than expected to build the Zeta Gundam. I'll contact you once it's completed. Now then, you better hurry on over to Isengrad. Right. The cows will be here any minute now. Go outside and wait. No, let's go see. If I recall, like, isn't the Yakushiki a range? Like, because I feel like I remember 
Mm. Not it in game, but like seeing it in something. It's from Zeta Gundam. Uh, one of its most iconic weapons, even though it wasn't part of the standard armament, was the Mega Bazooka Launcher, which is a gigantic beam cannon that it flies yeah. around with. So that's what I was sitting here thinking. It's like it's a gun. Like, type. So it definitely it might be a good range one. It uses beam sabers too. So, where was the logic repair here? That guy. Not the one with the desk. That is one. I believe. There we go. So, yeah. That was a pretty good session. Dickens Rock. Uh, got the Yakushiki. And next episode, we go to Isengrad or we're going to go back and finish the Lost City? Well, we need to finish the Lost City, see if we find any new, cool, just crazy stuff. Yeah. We need to grind and get some. Upgrades because I don't want to go in, you know, half cock. Yeah. So off camera, he'll work on getting Yakushiki up to spec with the rest of our guys. Firepower. Yeah. And you also said that we could do the Coliseum once we got the guy. Yes, but the Coliseum is really strong and we might get bopped a, a couple times. Well, we can still try it out. Yeah, we, we can get a lot of money from it at least. Well, anything else to add? Nope. Alright, so this has been Blake Cross EXC. And Ryoji 42. Power Flashing Blades Productions with MS Saga New Dawn. Tune in next time. We go do a whole bunch of stuff before we continue the main quest. Peace out. Peace.